Hi everyone. Um, we're going to do a fireworks display. We have two people, A and B, standing two miles apart that see a burst from fireworks display. After a period of time, the first person standing at point A hears the burst. One second later, the second person standing at point B hears the burst. If the display is known to occur due north of the person at point A, where did the fireworks display occur? So basically, we first need to note that all points where a burst could take place, <coughs> such that the time difference would be the same, that for the first burst um, would form a hyperbola with A and B as the foci, so or foci, however you want to say it. So basically, I'm not drawing it as such, but I'm putting the A and B. So this person A and B. Um, we're going to let X and Y, because that's what we have to solve for, uh, represent the location of the fireworks. The one thing that's not in this problem is, and you might not know, is that sound travels at 1,100 feet per second. So let me write this better. So it's 1,100 feet per second. Because we're going to need that information, and they didn't give you that. Okay, so 1,100 feet per second. So w the person A is 1,100 feet closer to the fireworks display than the person at point B. Okay, since the difference of the dif distance from AY to A and from A, X, Y to B is a constant 1100. Um, the point lies on the hyperbola whose foci are at A and B. So basically, we have 2A equal 1100, and that's coming from here. Sorry, coming from here. So A equals 5,500, all right? The distance between the two people is two miles. And uh, since we're talking about feet per second, we want to go ahead and uh, convert that to feet. So there's, um, we're going to have, each person is the foci, so that's C. So we have 2C equals 10, um, 1560. So basically C is 5280. You already should know that, um, what color is this? Green. You should already know that um, there's, if we do this in half, that's uh, 5280 feet per mile. So I'm just going to write it that way. And mainly because we're talking about feet here. All right. So now we have our A and we have our C. And with hyperbolas, we know that a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Or we could say that b squared equals c squared minus a squared. So we have um, b squared equals 5280 squared minus 550 squared. And that gives us 27,575,975,900. So that's your um, B squared. And so I'm going to just write my equation on the next slide. So I didn't take the square root of it because we have to square it anyway. So we have X squared over 550 squared minus, remember your equation of hyperbola, minus y squared over b squared. Our b squared, we didn't take the square root of it, so we already know what it is. 27,575,900. That equals 1. Since the fireworks display is due north of the individual A, we're going to let x equal the 5 two eight zero substitute and solve for y so basically 
right here, since we have this 5, 2, 8, 0, letting x equal 5, 2, 8, 0. And now we just have to find the y and put it in there. Okay, so we do that. We've done that several times on these problems. So we're going to do substitution. So we get 5, 2, 8, 0 squared over 550 squared minus y squared over 27,575 um, and 900. Now to solve for y, what I'm going to do is move the 1 over here and the y squared over there. So, um, well, I'm just going to do it the same way. So we're going to get negative y squared over 27,575,000 and 900 equals, um, I'm going to go, I went ahead and subtracted this on my calculations, so it's 1 minus uh, 5280 squared, I know I'm not supposed to do it this way, but I'm trying to save time, so over 50, uh, 550 squared, and I went ahead and did that, and I got negative um, 91.16. So when you cross multiply, and I'm going ahead and crossing with the negative down here, you're going to get y squared equals uh, 2,513,819,044. And you square root both sides, you get y equals 50,138. Okay, so therefore... The fireworks display was 50,158 feet due north of person A. And if you want to convert, this is uh, approximately 9.5 miles. So if you just want to divide this by 5280. Um, and that's all. The next problem is very similar, but it involves lightning strikes. So if you want another one of these, you can look at that video. Thank you and have a nice day. Bye-bye.